Hey guys and girls, gals, guys and gals. Today let's open this Charizard EX Premium Collection. I believe this is part of the Obsidian Flames set, but uh, I mean, look at these promos. Look at this promo, Charizard promo, you just gotta get it, right? I mean, buying the single probably would have been cheaper, but it's fun to open packs as well. Let's open it up. Actually, look at the box. It's like pretty special. Do you often see boxes like this? It's like textured to be like dragon scales. This is in Canadian, by the way. Let's open it up. Wait, it comes with a card protector? I'm so curious. Oh, it must be this thing in the back. Hmm. I'm curious to see what that's going to be. Here's the code card for the collection. Let's start from the little one first. We got a Charmander as one of our three promos. Looking very fierce. Looks like it's doing a fire spin maybe. Look at his little fierce face. Next, we got a Charmeleon looking more mature and composed. That's the same move. Both have heat tackle. And now let's take a look at Papazard. It's pretty cool. EX, it's got that cap thing. Damn, it looks so nice, honestly. It's like an etched card as well. You can feel the etches on it. And the white background makes it look super cool as well. Damn, I love this card. Oh my god, this is the card protector. I guess it's like a display. It's pretty hard actually. I guess it's meant to display the Charizard promo. Oh, okay. Oh, it's magnetic. Very cool. I wonder if it'll still fit if I have a sleeve on it. Doesn't really fit as well actually. Should I keep it in a sleeve or put it in here? Oh man. Ooh, there's a little stand for it too. I guess it's meant built for this, right? Maybe we should put it in here. Very cool. Do they often do this? I don't think I've seen this much before. Oh, it's Ultra Pro as well. Can you see it? It's interesting. It's like a uh, collab. This is so cool, it's like meant for display then. It's actually a pretty cool idea because a lot of people just collect and then put it away. But then now it's like forced to be displayed. I'm not gonna lie, this doesn't fit in as snugly as I thought it would. Am I doing this wrong? What? You think it just like slip in? I might have to like Google if I'm doing something wrong or if other people have this issue. Got some sleeves. Gotta say this does not look as cool as the white background, but you know, not complaining. Or am I complaining? I actually thought these would be mostly obsidian and flames, but we got two of each of uh, Scarlet Violet, Paldea Evolved and Obsidian Flames. Let's do them in order. Let's do the Scarlet and Violet ones first. Code card. Is it one to the front? Got a fire energy. Man, these cards feel so, th the booster pack feels so thick after I opened the McDonald ones earlier. Got a drowsy, Nimona. Got a strand of green on her hair, pretty cool. The chunk, Pico, Pico, do people say Pico? The baby. Espathra, kinda looks like an ostrich. It is an ostrich, ostrich Pokemon. With a bunch of colors though. Arvin, Cacturn, seen this one around. Cyclazar, our first reverse. Floet. 
We evolved from Flabebe that we saw earlier. Pretty cool. And then the other Cyclozar. Do Cyclozars always come in twos or something? Alright, let's move on to the next Scarlet and Violet pack featuring our starters. Looking up in wonderment. Is wonderment a word? Code card. Got a metal energy or steel energy. It's got a swirl effect, eh? These are energies. Wiglet, kind of like the new Diglet. Grieverd. Ghost Dog, Mass Shift. Ooh, our second doggo of the pack. Spupa. Oh, I didn't know there was one under Scatterbug. Interesting. Because when you get it in Pokemon Go, you just get a uh, Scatterbug. Crocodile. You can look at his shades. You can tell he's a crook. Flamigo. <laughs> okay. Basically, Flamingo without the N. Foretress. Torco as our first reverse. You usually see steam coming out of its nose, right? Or smoke. Squovit. King Gambit. King Gambit? You've also been by sharp, okay. Oh my god, yeah, dude, look at his head. It looks sharp. Very sharp. Something about it kind of looks like a bug, though. Is it just like the shape of him? Interesting. He looks kind of stoned or something. Are his whiskers? Whiskers is the wrong word. Is his mustache kind of like blades as well? Hmm. Let's move on to the Paddle Evolved. We got two of the same pack arts. But this one seems darker. That's weird. Is that on purpose? I didn't realize they were... I'm just trying to check, double check it's not an optical illusion. I didn't realize there were two shades of blue. Hmm. Maybe a different print run. Code card. Basic water energy. Mass shift. We saw one of these earlier. Oh man, Slackoth looks done. Very done. Paldian Wooper. This one's pretty cute. They turn they turned him brown for the Paldian form. Ooh, Pikachu, our mascot boy, Heracross. This one looks familiar. Did I open this before? Okay, this one looks familiar too. I think I opened like one of these before. I think I opened the ETB. So some of these do look familiar. Azumarill, Bravery Charm, this one looks familiar. Oh my gosh, it was like stuck. But we got the new boss's orders, I guess. Pretty cool, has a full art. I don't really know who this boss is because I haven't played Scarlet and Violet yet. It's our first nice pull in a while though. Pretty cool, so checking out the map, making some chess moves. And a weekly tough. What a nice, cheerful end of a pack. Let's do our next Paldo Evolve pack. This one with the darker art. Hopefully I didn't buy like a counterfeit Pokemon cards or something. Code card. One to the front. Basic leaf energy. Rookity. Magnemite. It's like hanging on with magnetism, I guess. Flinks. Oh my god, they're taking turns jumping the cliff. Combi. Two of them are cheerful. One of them looks kind of surprised. Pupitar. Is it just like flying through the air like a bullet? Man, okay. Flamigo. Is it meant to be like Amigo as well? Bombardier. Pseudo Udo. This is our first reverse, I think. 
This looks so cool. Reversal energy. Our next reverse. Three of them. Not sure how this works. Ooh, what? Another full art? Giacomo. We just pulled a train of full art. Now we get another one. This is so cool. This was in the last slot though. Boss's orders was in the second last earlier. Wonder how it works. It's got two stars here though. Boss's orders has two gold stars. Something about the new rarity system. I'm happy just looking at pretty cards though. Let's do our two Obsidian Flames packs. I have no idea what this Pokemon is. It looks like a goddamn engine tank or something. Let's open this one first. Code cards, why I keep giving them backwards? It's just more ergonomic? Ergonomic? Just how the way my hand goes. Basic lightning energy. Rhyme. Looks like a performer, maybe a rapper. Rock rough, sniffing for the little Pokeball, that's cute. Wiglet, our water diglet. Shuckle. Poltegeist. Volcarona. Mm, this is a cute art. It looks very calming. Diggersby. Oh my god, smashing the ground with his ears. That's kind of scary. Are those abs? No way. Right. Jesus Christ, imagine those were abs. That'd be so scary. Toxtricity as our first reverse. Toxel as our second reverse. Right? That's coincidence. Clefable EX. This is so cute. It looks almost 3D-ish, but also not. Looks like it's uh, powering up its little finger here. Very cool effect. We've got these little stars popping out as well. Very, uh... Pretty. Oh my gosh! I don't know if you can see, but the hollow effect is like a bunch of stars and stuff as well. Very cool. Do all of them have stars, or is it just for this Clefairy one? Because it's like star themed a little bit. Clefairy ball. Alright, our last pack of this collection. Got the Charizard pack art. Let's see if we pull something cool. Code card, I'll spin it around. One to the front. Fighting energy. Snubble. <laughs> like how it's sitting like a human on a chair. Capsicid. Spicy pepper. I think I've seen maybe it's evolved form before. The capsa is like reference to the chemical that's spicy. Drober. Cup chew. Oh, that's cute. Buffalant. Bash Buffalo. It's like a new version of Tauros almost, but it's not evolved from it. Crabobinable. Wow. It goes from like a boxer to like the abdominable snowman or something. Wooly Crab? Like kind of like a hairy crab? King Gambit. King Gambit or King Gambit? Oh, Diglett. Is that our first reverse? Yep. Whole digging nogging. <laughs> Palpitoad. Oh my god, I never realized its tongue could go so long. It's kind of um, jarring. Togekiss. It's cute. Final, final evolved form of Togepi. <laughs> it looks like a chonky boy in this art, actually. I wonder if Greninja or Papa Toad has a longer tongue. Diglett, Diglett, Diglett. Thanks for watching.